Hey everyone, Stacey Jackson here with Cole Banker Realty. Today on my vlog, I'm gonna tell you what it's like to shop for a home right now in the coronavirus era. Uh, this is for California. There are some interesting things I think that you'll notice that are different from normal summer home sale season. So I'll just jump right in. We've been doing this since March. So now we agents pretty much have it down into a routine. The first thing that you're gonna want, you have to be approved by a lender before you go home shopping. This is a good rule of thumb, coronavirus or not. You really need to make sure that you can afford the house that you want to look at. Otherwise, you're wasting your own time, your agent's time, the seller's time. So just as a matter of respect, check with your lender, see how much you can get pre-approved for. Right now, the sellers will be wanting to see a copy of the letter showing that the lender will pre-approve you for the price of the home. Otherwise, they won't even let you in the door because they're trying to minimize the number of strangers coming through their house, especially when we don't know who's carrying a virus and who isn't. The second thing is a form called the Property Entry Advisory Declaration, or PEAD, or PEED. So this form, it's a California state form. What it asks is if you have been exhibiting any coronavirus symptoms and whether you've been in contact with anybody that you know has been tested positive for COVID-19. So you need to sign a new one of these forms every day. Things can change from day to day. Your agent will provide this form to you and you can just sign it on DocuSign and they'll send you a fresh one every day. After it's completed, your agent will send the form to the seller's agent and then set an appointment for you to view the home. If you have been in contact with somebody who you know tested positive for coronavirus, most agents are more than willing to go on your behalf to the home and do a FaceTime tour with you or take a video if you're unable to FaceTime live. A lot of people already do this for out of state buyers, but now we're leveraging this technology for other buyers who might not be available to tour the home in person. Um, technology has really let us deal with this situation in a really, really great way. The third thing is during home showings. And like I said at the beginning, this is specifically for California. When you go in to view the home, there's a limit on the number of people inside the house. Everyone must have signed the PEAD form. There will be one agent and two buyers allowed in the home. If more people want to see the home, they have to wait outside until the first tour is done and the agent can go back out and bring the other people through. This is why we're recommending don't bring your children with you to view homes right now. You can take videos or photos and show the kids later after you've seen it. When you're inside during the showing, everybody has to keep their mask on at all times. Most agents will provide rubber gloves for you to wear. Another thing is just ask the agent to open doors, cabinets, closets, touch doorknobs. If we can control touching to only one person, it's easier for the agent to come through afterwards and wipe everything down with a Clorox wipe. We really wanna protect the sellers, but also accommodate the buyers who are interested in the ins and outs of each home that they're viewing. You'll notice that a lot of listings now are using 3D tour technology. So take advantage of this. View the 3D tour online and narrow it down to your top two or three homes. That saves everybody time, protects the sellers, and protects you. That way you can shorten your home search to just your top favorite homes. So summer is the most uh, popular home shopping season. Most people want to buy and move and get their family in the new home before the school year starts. We don't really know what the school year will look like this fall, but... Like I said, summer's the hot season. A lot of homes are coming on the market. We're really seeing a resurgence of listings that dipped sharply in April. So contact me today if you have questions about what it's like to shop for a home right now. I can put you into contact with some of my trusted lenders and we can start using the tips discussed in this video to begin your home search. Please leave a comment if you have questions or call or email me. Like I said, Stacy Jackson with Cobalt Banker Realty in San Diego. Have a great day.